What's up guys, Wade Willis here for Wade Reacts, here to react to the Star Wars Visions trailer. I don't know too much going into this, I know that some anime studios are supposed to be doing some Star Wars, I believe, episodes. I'm, I'm not completely sure. I'm a huge Star Wars fan and I'm a huge anime fan and those of you who have been on my channel for a while know that those are the two things I cover. So I'm so pumped uh, that uh, both of my worlds are kind of combining into one thing. So. Um, yeah, I'm going to watch, react, and then kind of give my thoughts on uh, the future of this project and what I'm excited for, or maybe some things that I'm worried about, uh, if there are any from the trailer. And yeah, guys, don't forget to like the video and subscribe to my channel for tons of anime content. I'm going to be doing more Star Wars content with The High Republic coming up. I've been reading those books, so I'm going to be doing reviews of those coming up, so be on the lookout for that as well. Okay. Oh, dang. Star Wars Visions is going to be an exciting anime anthology series coming That's... to Disney Plus in September. Huh. Japanese animation inspired a lot of the people at Lucasfilm over the years. We this loved is... the idea of seeing Star Wars expressed. And these in that are like way. rough sketches and stuff, but this looks cool. I like the concept. Each one so of these studios that we approached, Trigger found hardcore and production Star Wars fans. Okay. They all had a story they wanted to I'm tell. sure I know some of the other studios too. I need to just research them and see what they've done before. But those ones stick out to me. They, they go in on the animation. <laughs> We were looking for something from the heart and soul of the individual creators. They are their visions to the lens of Star Wars. Oh, this is awesome. Wars. Yeah, so we're going to get a different vibe of anime in each so one many from the studio, genres it seems like. Big and bold, romantic and sweeping, funny, comedic. で、えっと、この作品独自のえっと、ロックオペラということで。オッケー。日本の山岳文化みたいなことをしっかり描けたらな。韓国教の双子が生まれて、これがどうなるのかというのが基本的な設定ですね。おお。ナイトセーバーって
in anime it would be like a demi human, but I, I it, the little like bunny type girl. But I really liked that concept. The, and I talked earlier like implementing like the samurai kind of aspect into it and making it like that. Like there's so many similarities between like uh, the western and samurai style uh, classic movies that. I don't know. It, may, it makes sense going into that. And like I said, Mandalorian is basically a Western, especially season one. So, uh, yeah, this is a genius idea. I liked We were just seeing kind of like concept art. We weren't really seeing um, actual like clips or anything uh, substantial. Um, everything was like really short that they showed us. So I'm intrigued to see where it goes from here, I'm going to like research uh, further after this because I'm, I'm going to cover this series like in depth when the things are coming out because this looks awesome. I'm hoping that the episodes are at least like an hour. That would be great um, if they were like an hour long because I feel like if it was like a one anime studio doing a 20 minute thing, that's just, uh, it's hard to tell a whole story in that amount of time. Maybe it's going to be longer than an hour, but I'm I, I wouldn't be surprised if they're kind of like short stories that are an hour. So I'm I'm super proud for this. If you if I'm wrong with anything I said, let me know in the comments below. Um, and if you're excited for this, let me know in the comments too, because this is probably one of the most exciting things I've heard of uh, in a while. Just both those things coming together, it makes so much sense. Um, and I think this um it will really help both i can't even say anime is a brand but i guess it it kind of is but it's just it is growing dramatically in the u.s and around the world and having it attached to something like star wars uh is only going to help it grow and star wars branching out and doing something like different this is a bit of a risk uh and kind of doing this it makes me really uh, happy with how they're moving the direction they're trying all these different mediums the in my opinion from i'm almost done with uh two books in the high republic like that is actually going pretty well so far i actually like the overarching story that they're doing a lot of people were worried about that so it seems like star wars is in uh like going in a really good direction and i'm super excited for it but yeah, let me know what you guys think in the comments below.